why is Scalar UG different from all the other programs in the country, especially for computer science and engineering? Let me spend the next few minutes explaining that. How do you look at a program? What are the components of a program? One is, what is the curriculum? What am I going to learn? Two is, how am I going to learn? Three is, the final ecosystem that I get which develops me as a person, as a whole. And finally, what are the companies hiring? What about my outcome? What about my safety net? Those are the four things that matter. I'll go one by one. Firstly, the curriculum. Uh, the way the curriculum is designed is that the first one and a half years, make sure that anything and everything that is fundamental to computer science, that makes you a good engineer, that is covered in those 1.5 years. This is what gets covered in the first three to four years of usual colleges without losing the depth of content. Usual colleges have a lot of distraction. We get rid of those distractions. Post that one and a half year, you have one year internship. So by the end of 2.5 years, not only are you good at CS fundamentals, but you also have one year of experience, real world industry paid experience. You're as good as a engineer with one year of experience, which is you're already steps ahead of every other CS graduate in the country. And then the last 18 months, last one and a half years, is spent on making sure that you learn the things that makes you a very highly qualified senior engineer. So you have a bunch of specializations to choose from. All of these help build the skills that make senior to very senior engineers. Let me get into a little bit more depth of that. So the first 18 months, when I say that you get really good at CS fundamentals, that means that you, you can write any encryption algorithm, you can build an e-commerce website yourself, you have the depth of front-end and UI engineering where you can build something like a Google Excel sheet yourself, um, and you can build servers or machines that can take 100,000 concurrent requests per second, which is scaling a single machine. You can also do basic data analysis. You know about product metrics. You know about the process to create products, which is basics of product management. And then you start your internship. A lot of this content, by the way, is still not covered in college curriculum. This is the first 18 months. Then you do a one-year internship. During the internship, you have one-on-one -on -one mentorship from a mentor whose whole and sole goal is to make sure that you have the right kind of support, you have the right kind of nudges to do the right things, which helps convert your internship into a full-time job. Hence, in all probability, by the time you complete your internship, there's a good probability that you would have a full-time job offer on the side as well. The last 18 months, there we want to make sure that you graduate with very high salaries, with high tech competency. So hence the, the specializations that you have are around AI machine learning. They are around competitive coding. So you learn things that are very, very important for companies like let's say Google, Facebook, the top 0.1% companies in the world. You have a specialization on high frequency trading. Um, these are again a set of companies that are fewer in number, but they pay the best salaries all around the world. And you have a specialization on data science. So you have a list of these specializations that you can choose from. Makes you a senior engineer. Um, that's about the curriculum. Now, all of this would go to waste if it is not delivered in the right fashion, which is how is it delivered? So firstly, it is delivered by people who have been there, done that. People who teach are people who have built things at scale before themselves. For example, I am one of the teachers. I led the team that built Facebook Messenger, which I hope a lot of you have already used. Uh, people who teach are people who have worked on Hotstar before, Zomato before, um, Uber before, Ola before, um, and they are the ones who are now translating this real world knowledge into what you should learn. 
apart from teachers. So the moment the class is over, we make sure that even solving the assignments, which, are, which simulate these real world scenarios, happen right after the class. And there to help you with these assignments, there are these batch success managers. They are there with you. If you get stuck, they help unblock you. Not just that, even pushing you to make sure you're doing the assignments, you're attending these classes, it is their responsibility in some ways. And apart from that, you also have access to personal mentors. Mentors are people who are already successful in the tech industry. They in some ways adopt you as an elder brother or a sister to make sure you're making the right decisions for your career. You're learning the right way. If there are weaknesses, then they flag it to you as well as us so that we work on those weaknesses. Mentors ensure you get a lot of personal attention. You're not just a random person for us in a lot of people in college. Every single person matters. So that's how you learn. Then the ecosystem, who are you learning with? You're learning with very, very smart people just like you. We are very, very selective. We only have 200 seats in the first cohort. And we expect that we'll end up getting more than 10,000 odd applications for this. It is our goal to make sure that we get very, very smart people in the cohort. So you're going to be learning with them. And finally, the placements, the outcomes. As of today, Scalar has more than 900 employer partners. For an <laughs> intake of 200 people, you have more than 900 employer partners. Unless you really, really, really screw up in the curriculum, if you do not focus on learning at all, chances are one of these employers would happily end up hiring you. A combination of all of this makes it a program which is not like any other in the country. It's, it's magnitudes ahead of any other undergraduate program in the country. Again, I would, I would urge you to do your own research as well before taking the final decision. But I can assure you, you cannot go wrong with Skiller. Thank you.